Hi everybody, I want to construct a congruent angle. So we'll just start with some angle. And let's say I want to construct an angle that's congruent to this angle that you see on the board. So what we'll do is we'll start by drawing a segment. I'm going to go ahead and put a point uh, on the segment. I'll put a point on the vertex of the original angle. And the next thing I'm going to do is I'll get my compass out. And I'm going to draw a an arc. And I'm going to with the compass locked, I'm going to go ahead and draw an arc on the segment from the point that you see. Okay, now the next thing I want to do is um, grab a different color. Okay, so what I want to do next is I want to, I'm going to make some blue points so you can know what I'm talking about. What I want to do is I want to measure, I want to take my compass and I want to draw an arc from one blue point to the other blue point. So in other words, I'm just measuring how wide that is with my compass. So let me drag the compass over. I'm going to unlock my compass so that I can get this just right. Okay, so you could see I have the two blue points. The sharp part is on one point. The pencil part is on the other point. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to make sure that the compass is locked. And I'm going to take, um, I'm going to take the compass and I'm going to go to the other arc that I've drawn, drawn on the right side. Now I'm going to make sure I have a blue point on the other, on the other arc. So let's drag Let's drag the compass. You could see I'm going to take the compass and put the sharp point on the blue point. Uh, you know, it didn't look like I had my compass locked. Let me go back. I want to make sure that I'm at the right point. Okay. All right. So, yeah, I locked it. Now that I'm sure I locked my compass, I'm going to draw another arc I'm going to put the um, put the compass away make a blue point now what I'm going to do is I am going to use my segment tool and I am now going to connect the vertex to that other blue point there you have the congruent angle Now, just to just for fun, I'm going to go ahead and measure. I'm just going to take my protractor, just for fun. I want to see how how accurate this really is. Okay, this looks like about maybe like 53 degrees. Let me see if the one on the right is about 53 degrees. And it is. Looks like it's about 50 degrees. So um, let me know if you have any questions or you need any help with this.